Hello friends. In this video I will show you how Cupid Love Admin Panel works. Go to yourdomain.com slash admin. Here is a login page for Admin Panel. Enter admin username and password. Default admin username is admin at yopemail.com and password is admin123 Validate Google CAPTCHA Now, we are in admin panel. It is a dashboard. You will see some statistics on the dashboard such as Total user registration for today Total user registration for this week And same for the this month Scroll down and you will find how many of users are there How many members are online through iOS app and how many of them are men and women On the left panel you will see the navigation menu. There are several section you can explore. We will see them one by one. Let's go to add mob. From this page, you can enable or disable this module in iOS app. Here, there are two setting options. Enable for all account, if it is enable, add mob will be activated to all iOS users except who has paid through an app purchase. And enable for all new registration, if it is enable, AdMob module will be activated for new register user. If you want to change the site logo, go to site settings and upload a logo from here. Let's explore push notification. From this page, you can send the push notification to iOS user at the same time. On this page, you can see the past push notification sent by admin. Title, message, sent to this users, and date. Let's create a push notification. Click on add. Add title and type message that you want to send. Select users and submit. Push notification has been sent. From search page, you can search any user. Just type a character in the search bar and you will see the results. Click on profile name, and you can see user's profile. On this page, you will see the all block users request sent by users. Here you can see this request was received from this user, and this user wants to block this user. As admin you can permanent block any user by clicking on this button. Let's block this user. Click on block. Now. This blocked user cannot log into the web app as well as on iOS app. You can also unblock any user by going to block users section. Click on unblock and this user will be unblocked and this user will be able to log in into the web app as well as in iOS app. That's it for the admin panel. Thanks for watching this video.